New York, it's late night with Conan O'Brien. Tonight, Emmy Award winning actor Jimmy Smith, Reverend Al Sharpton, and Peter Pan enthusiast Randy Constant. Thank you, thank you. That's my new thing. That's my new thing on this show is I pretend there's lots of audience up here, too. So at home, that looks huge. I'm like, yeah, all right, I'm getting to you, too. <laughs> they can't see at home, those saps. <laughs> Uh-oh. Just audience all around. Thank you. Thank you very much. Okay. It got real quiet real fast. <laughs> That's my effect on audiences. <laughs> they start out laughing, and then they're like, oh my God, look at him. We have a, uh, we have, no, we have a, it's Friday. That's all I can say. In the summer, all you want to do, in the summer, just about getting to Friday, and then just going slack, which is what tonight's all about. <laughs> no, we have, uh, we worked hard tonight. We have a really good show. We have a fantastic show. Much to talk about up front. Big, big news today. Everyone's talking about this. Martha Stewart was sentenced today. Did you hear this? She got five months. That's the latest news. What does that boo mean? <laughs> you wanted her to get more? Yeah! Oh, my God! <laughs> what kind of people are you? I never want to get in front of this jury. <laughs> no, boo! Kill him. No, she got five months. Yeah, today, after being sentenced to five months in prison, Martha Stewart told reporters, I am not afraid. That's what she said. Yeah, the odd part is Martha's cellmate said, really, I'm very afraid. <laughs> it's a scary lady. It was just announced that Hillary Clinton will speak at the Democratic Convention, and in fact, she will introduce her husband, Bill Clinton. Yeah. yeah. Introduce him, yeah. Which means... Which means he will be introduced as that lying son of a bitch. <laughs> and bring him right out. It's nice. They say that, and then there's music, and then it comes out. Thank you. Thank you very much. Thank you. All right. <laughs> this week, the city of Las Vegas unveiled a new monorail system that's going to link all the casinos. That's right. Yeah. Which means... There are now two ways to get mono on the strip. <laughs> I like that. Because <laughs> it's true. <laughs> You're gonna like this. It's been reported that, that two members, two members of the 80s rock group Megadeth Woo! are suing each other yeah. over money. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, apparently they both saw the returnable beer can at the exact same time. <laughs> Fighting over it. Wow! <laughs> wow, it's a anti-Martha, pro-Megadeth crowd. <laughs> I'm zeroing in on who these people are. Well, I'll win you people over soon. That I promise. And then I got to mention this, the Department of Health and Human Services officially recognized obesity as a medical illness. Finally happened. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah, doctors say symptoms include shortness of breath and wideness of ass. So look for that. So the ass gets Thank you. 
Thank you. Thank you. Thank you very much. Thank you. Wow, that's great. <laughs> Thanks for playing along. <laughs> that's going to look amazing at home. I'm in Lincoln Center. <laughs> All right. We have a, uh, we got a great show this, this evening. Very great. happy about our show. First guest, people love this man. Of course, you know him from NYPD Blue. He was in L.A. Law. Now he's doing Shakespeare in the Park. He's doing Much Ado About Nothing here in New York City. Jimmy Smits. <laughs> he's a good guy. They are all, not all celebrities are good. He's a good man. We also have uh, always got something to say. Not worried about this segment. I know there'll be a lot of talking going on. Reverend Al Sharpton. Yeah. Yeah. You got your Jimmy Smiths. You got your Reverend Al Sharpton. Let me discuss briefly our third guest. <laughs> have not met the man yet. I can only tell you what I know, and this is worth sticking around for. He calls himself the living Peter Pan. Yeah. And he takes this, he takes this very seriously, so please stick around. Randy Constant is on the show. He's the living Peter Pan. This is no joke. Whatever, here, Max Weinberger, the Max Weinberger, so Max, go ahead. You got big weekend plans, Max? Oh, yeah. <laughs> you could just say yes and then tell me what you're doing, but no. I got nothing going on either. Nah. Want to do something? <laughs> That's OK. I'm good. <laughs> <laughs> Sorry, no. No, I'd love to do something with you. To do something with you, but we have to talk about these things earlier in the week because I got a lot of stuff going on. <laughs> yeah. Cut to me eating nachos and looking at the <laughs> wall at home. <laughs> we'll hook up soon, I swear we will. <laughs> you can't buy chemistry like this. You just, <laughs> you just have to find it. Lightning in a bottle, that's what it is. It's lightning in a bottle. All right. <laughs> I just remember this is a real show that goes into people's homes, and I got to pull it together. 